Yo, what's up guys, it's King Mimikyu, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Super Mystery Dungeon. In the last episode, we made it through the depths of the prehistoric ruins and the submerged cave. And we also ran into Nuzleaf again, which, you know, he wanted to turn us to stone. And we also learned that we were summoned by some sort of ancient Pokemon. I guess we will find out today who it is. So, yeah. And I also checked out one of my friends, Nate, uh, Kit. He let me know that there's a way I can uh, change tactics. And hopefully that will change Oshawott's personality to not going after uh, all the items. Hopefully that works. And also here's the question of today. If you guys were to become a Pokemon, what Pokemon would you be that isn't mythical or legendary? Let me know in the comments. And yeah, let's go ahead and start today's episode. This might be a little long one, I don't know. Chapter 21, Dark Matter. Now we're going to try and make sure you guys can see. There we go. Let me start off by telling you about Dark Matter. The truth is this. Dark Matter is just one big bundle of hate, unhappiness, and pain. It comes from all the Pokemon in the world. It's just hating things? Yes. Every time you feel annoyed with someone, every time you feel jealous of someone, every negative feeling that any of us have, all come together and grow, and they seem to form what is now attacking the Tree of Life. So basically, something's attacking the Tree of Life. Hold on a sec. You said negative feelings, right? But doesn't like everyone feel that way sometimes? If that's what creates dark matter, then isn't it impossible to ever get rid of it? Well... That's right. In the ancient past, it was stopped by the alignment of the stars. And so the worst danger was averted. But Dark Matter was never defeated. Dark Matter will never go away. What? But then, what can we do? We still don't have any answers to that. But we still have to do something or our world is finished. That's why we've been trying to find some breakthrough by examining the past. Why do I t Okay, let me fix the camera a little bit. There we go. Why do I tell you what I found out? Long ago, as it's happening right now, because... That's what I mean by long ago. This planet did begin to be pulled too close to the sun. The Pokemon living in that ancient time tried to fight against Dark Matter, but... It wasn't just them alone. There was a single human who battled alongside them. A single human? Now, this is only my own theory, but if I had to say, I'd guess that that human was you, Blaze. Blaze? Of course, we can't confirm the theory due to the Blaze memory loss, and whether or not it really was Blaze. Well, I guess we can confirm that it might be me, because I am a human. And the fact remains that the human continued to fight on until the stars could do their work. This one human was able to stop Dark Matter in its tracks, if only for a time. But Dark Matter rises time and again with the movement of the planet. The day will come when it rises yet again, perhaps knowing that and wanting to help those who could fight in the future. The Pokemon of that ancient age prepared certain countermeasures, measures such as the sealed spring, and the scarves you two wear now. What are scarves? I mean, sure, they do seem to have some kind of strange power. Well, of course, Kobe. They have, like, magical powers which allows us to evolve. Hmm. That is because those scarves were made by an ancient Pokemon known as Mew. They were made using materials from the Tree of Life itself. Though, countless generations, those scarves were passed down from hand to hand. Until they ended up with you, Kobe. But why should I have something so important? Hmm, I need coffee, just kidding. That's exactly what I like to know. As soon as I brought up the question of the ancient scars with Ampharos here, he told me he told me to look at the scars that you and Blaze wore around your necks. And they do look identical to the scars that I saw in the ancient past. I couldn't believe it to to be honest. Well, I can't believe that we are ancient. Neither can I. My old pops has always said that I had these scars on me when I when he found me. He said I was wrapped up in them. But how did that come to be? 
I suppose thinking about it isn't going to help us any right now. You said that the ancient Pokemon was called Mew, the one who made the scars from the Tree of Life. That's right. Mew was something of a leader back then when Pokemon when Pokemon first battled Dark Matter. Hmm. Blaze, do you remember and remember what Ampharos, I mean not Ampharos, Nuzleaf said when we were in the prehistoric ruins? Yeah. You remember he said I had the uh, he said I was summoned by, like, ancient Pokemon known as Mew. Hmm, those we've said that what called Blaze here from the human world was the spirit of an ancient Pokemon. Might not that, might not, might that not be referring to Mew? So Mew is the one? It is a theory, of course. But who, but we believe that you did fight Dark Matter once before and eat past Blaze. So your experience and knowledge of that battle would be necessary in the future. And that is why Mew, or at least his spirit, called you back from the human world to help us once more. But then you lost your memory when fighting against the BM. Blaze, if you can remember anything, anything at all, no matter how small. I got no memories. I can't, I can't remember anything. Well, even if your memories are lost, there is one thing we could say for certain. The scars worn by Kobe and you were made to battle Dark Matter, so those scars must serve somehow as keys to defeating Dark Matter. And, Kobe, if I'm not mistaken, this battle will be yours to fight, Kobe. Mine? Why me? Come, comrades, it's time we got moving. We, if we let things go on as they are, Dark Matter will leave and take the planet with it. Abandon our planet to be consumed by the blazing sun. We must act at once. Wait, do we even know where the Tree of Life is? On this island, dummy! Oh, you just insulted you! Ahead of us lies Primeval Forest, and within it, the Tree of Life. Fire Island where we all went together once is also quite near. It has taken us a great deal of work to find this place, but we are finally here. It's time, Blazing Kobe. Guess we're taking on a dungeon. Now, I know Kit told me that, um, uh, go to tactics meeting. I don't know if that's the case, or maybe Kobe and Blaze are addicted to items. Um, I'm gonna take a few reviver seeds because I know how long this dungeon is. There we go. So yeah, we're gonna do Primeval Forest. Uh, do we wanna go with someone? Yeah, we'll choose Amphrost. We're gonna set Amphrost on go after foes, cause Amphrost is quite strong. So yeah, welcome to Primeval Forest. Um, Amphrost, you're gonna be going after foes. Cause you're gonna be a dashing murderer. Get away from here. No, 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 no. Go after foes. Go after foes, Amphros. Go after foes. 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 Amphros is gonna go after foes. We're gonna sing up tongue in you guys. We're gonna go after foes. And we're gonna go after foes. I wish we could play as Amphros. He's so good. He is so strong. I wanna play as Amphros. Let me play as him. He's better than Kobe. I sent him to go out. Oh, Kobe's surrounded. Kobe, I'm coming to save your life. And Frost is set to go after foes, so he's got these guys. As long as he doesn't waste like 10 Reviver Seeds, like Kobe, I think we got this. Why does Lilligan have so much health? Kobe, we need to talk, man.
Kobe, this is partially the reason why I don't want you to fight a grass type. Okay, Amphros finished off the Lil again. I'm gonna use some guiding wands because I. You know what? I think we're good for right now. This dungeon isn't as difficult. But I don't want to take any chances. Road to Primeval Force. I don't know if I said that correctly. Blaze is gonna fight this lit, this chair rim. Does nothing. That does nothing, Blaze. I mean, Kobe. Wow, we're actually doing pretty good. I love this theme. This theme is so peaceful and awesome. Like, everything I ex would expect from Road to Primeval Forest. It's actually a pretty easy dungeon. You know, f being one of the last few remaining dungeons in this game. Uh, yeah. I don't know. We have a really hard boss coming up. And there's Bayonet in this dungeon. How much health do you have, Bayonet? Thank you, Amphros. Dashing Wonder, that's why. Well, we're gonna call you the Murder one. Wait, wait, wait. <sighs> Didn't get the Emera, because we were too slow. Kobe, I didn't set you to go after foes. Kobe. Kobe. Where are the stairs? Where are the stairs? We're gonna find the stairs and get out of this forest. We made it through halfway and we're gonna continue. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Kobe. I mean, Esper, stop going after foes. Really? Wait. I want to know. I want to know right now. I want to know right now. Who picked it up? Who picked it up? And our bag's too full? Wait, what? Let me just fix the camera a little bit. There we go. Um, we got Power Boost Y. So, my eyes didn't deceive me. Nidoran, you're not supposed to have so much health, man. You're just a Nidoran. And we're gonna use the- oh no, no, don't go with the options, king. We're gonna use our guiding wands, cause... The stairs are right beneath us. Why not, right? Why weren't- why wouldn't they be beneath us? Seventh floor. We're making good progress, we have power boost Y. Which Arceus was like, you know... I'm gonna brace the- mm, I really don't like this. I really don't like this. We are all confused. We are legit all confused, except for Kobe. Okay. Let's all not get confused. Shadow Sneak. It's like a legit black shadow that just cuts through us. You struggling, Celebi? Ooh, gold bars, yay! Why, Esper? 
I would like to know why you go after foes. Have you been learning? I think you're learning from Kobe. <laughs> no, what have I done? Oh my god. What have I, what has King done? I completely embarrassed myself. Dude, Amphros, help him! What have I done? Guys, let's pretend that you guys all did not see that. Let's all pretend that you guys did not see that. Let's all pretend you did not see that. Guys? You guys did not see what I did to Kobe. No! Guys, don't look! I'm hurting him! I meant to click the guiding one. I am so sorry, Kobe. Looks like you're just gonna have to stay here. Really, Amphros? You're missing. Amphros, get your act together. Kill this overgrown leaf looking thing. Thank you. I'm sorry, Kobe. Amphros. Amphros, what are you doing? You're teaching everyone to go. Kobe, I'm sorry, man. There we go. I am so sorry, you guys. I did not mean to show you guys me paralyzing Kobe. We finally made it. This is Primeval Forest, or at least a part of it. Hmm. It's uh, pretty dark, isn't it? I can't see two feet in front of me. The canopy is indeed quite dense, but I don't believe the actual forest is all that large, so we should not be be far from the Tree of Life. Oh, I see light ahead. It looks like we could get out of that way. Whoa. Is that it? It got to be the Tree of Life. What else could it be? It could be like, um, the Tree of Beginning or whatever from Cario and the Mystery of Mew. I can't believe I par paralyzed Kobe twice today. I guess this is revenge for Kobe not listening to me. Like, I paralyzed him twice. What a colossal tree. It doesn't have coffee anywhere on it. Look how many branches it has. Hmm. But no leaves anywhere. It looks... It looks dead. It looks nearly dead. Look at the top. What is that thing? There's something... Some black th thing smoldering up there. Is that it? Yes, I'd say that's our dark matter. I think we're out of time. Let's get up there at once. How? Let's see. Um, how? We'll just have to climb the tree naturally. Hmm. I think you're cheating, Selby, because you can fly. We can fly, so we'll go up ahead to scout things out. Halt. No, we've ended BM. And Mr. Bur Bacon Bird or Steak Wings. Bacon Bird or Steak Wing. And Evil Eveltal. I also, you know, yeah. We all are quite are acting oddly. They seem to be in pain. That's it! BM! You're the BM from before. Nuzleaf and the other BM, they've been acting strange all this time. Like they're not even there. Like they've lost all sense of self. What does that mean? Dark matter control must be growing stronger. Which means, we're about to die! 
kidding. That we have no time to waste. Oh no. Arrgh. Shadows like the ones in the Voidlands. You guys, that's enough already. Just stop. Arrgh. I'm scared, okay? I'm scared to be sent to the Voidlands. But even more than that, I can't stand this. I can't stand doing this kind of thing. Not a minute longer. BM. Stop it. He's like, channel my inner dark motions. Throw gas at me. Strange alien thing. Well, he's dead. Well, he died. Um, I don't know why he turned on his own friend. BM. They turned him to, into stone. Their ability to turn Pokemon into stone. That's going to be our greatest hurdle. If we get hit with a blast like that, we're finished. Yeah. What? You're aiming at me? Esper, get out of the way! Bro? Bro? Again? Our harmony scarves. Bro? Bro? If we get five likes on this video, thank you everyone. We're evolving on screen. Dude, we gotta hit five likes on this video, man. I would appreciate it. Boys, check you out. It's just like what happened when we fought Entei that time. It's like the Tree of Life resonated with our scarves, and that's it. Your scarves are made for the Tree of Life after all, and Fire Island isn't far from here. Your scarves must have been resonating with the Tree of Life that time as well. And I'd bet that it was the Tree of... Wait, there we go. And that it was the Tree of Life's power that respelled those shadows Nuzleaf threw at us. The Tree of Life and those scarves saved us from being turned to stone. Then that means... Bingo, the Tree of Life isn't dead. It's still alive and kicking. It doesn't even have feet. There's still hope, and as an aside, Amphrost trees don't kick. We are not dead! As long as we can keep ourselves from being turned to stone, we can still fight this. We'll repel... Pa we will get past these tools of darkness and take on Dark Rider itself. Yeah. To arms, comrades. Fight. Here we go, you guys. Oh my god, I'm nervous. Okay, Toby's going after Eveltal. We need to plan this out, you guys. Uh, I think I'm taking down Nuzleaf first. So we'll target Nuzleaf. Kobe's just going straight up for Yveltal. We're gonna take up on Nuzleaf. Bro! Bro! Relax! Yveltal, you don't- Oh my god! We're, we're probably gonna die from this. Relax! Okay, Nuzleaf should be dead. Only one more hit from someone. Someone hitting this weird looking monkey thing. Okay, Nuzleaf is out. If we could get five likes on this video, guys, I will thank you to the bottom of my heart. Okay, we need to kill this Evel Tall. Okay. Okay. Okay, you're gonna get confused. You're gonna get shocked. Where are you aiming? Um, we're gonna pull up an alliance because I know this might not kill you, Valtol.
A bell toll is down, down, down like a burning pit of fire. Well, why press A? One down. We did it, you guys. Victory for King. Right. Yay, we did it. Defeated the second last boss. Oh. Uh, when the world where we might be now. How did we get here? They're gone. Not even the others disappeared. Where did they go? I don't know. For a moment, they seemed as though they had, been, had recovered themselves, but... That isn't what matters now, team. We have to keep moving. You're right. Let's go. <sighs> huh? Esper? Did you just laugh? Yeah, you think Esper laughs like that? It wasn't me. These deaths sounded nothing like me. <sighs> That's not. That doesn't sound like any of us. And it's like the voice is coming from right inside my own head. All of creation. At last. At last the time has come. Now I shall leave this world. It sounds like several different voices. And yet, it's like they all speak as one. No, it can't be. Is it the voice of? Those negative, these negative feelings. Is this dun da 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 dark matter? Now what? Oh no. Oh no. Ah, the tree of life. It's going. Oh no. If this video gets five likes, guys, thank you, man. I owe you so much. If this video gets 5 likes, no, let's get this video to 8 likes. 8 likes, everyone. If we could get this video to 8 likes, you guys will be the best. 8 likes. This is an epic episode. We fight Ivelto and we beat him on our first try. Oh, come on, why? We've changed back because the Tree of Life left the planet. Celebi, can you wrap warp there? I've been trying since the second it pulled from the ground, but the distortion created by dark matter are too strong. I won't let it end this way. Bro, Kobe. Bro. No, I can't make it. This can't be the end. Bro. Now we... Not when we fought so hard. Oh my god, Kobe. Kobe, but it's too far. Kobe, I'll give you a boost. Jirachi, bro. I'm next. Bro, just a little farther. No, it's still too far. I'm not going to make it. Is this? Kobe. Bro, please, don't you dare give up. Look at that face. I'll get you up there so you can just keep going. Thank you, Blaze. You're always the one who... Yo. I'll reach it. Flying Otter. I have to reach it. Just a little more. Almost there, and... Dead. Falling harder. No! Ow, 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 ow. Did we just kill him? 
And Frost, did you break my fall? That I did. Even for someone as marvelous as me, though, absorbing such a blow was a bit tough. Jirachi, we can still fly. And that's what we'll do. Do we get to save? No, it's getting farther and farther ahead. We can't even catch up to it. Now, now what do we do? Bro. We're gonna make- uh, All of creation hearken to my word. What do you guys think of my Dark Matter voice? The tree of life shall wither and fall. Devoid of all power. The tree of life now flies through space to be drawn into the sun. The world no longer spins. The course of the planet is now set. To, it, it shall be consumed by the sun as well. I am, no, me, I'm, we are, all together, dark matter, and we shall turn, return this word to the free world, to the void. We were born of you all. Oh, really? All of creation brought this forth. The hatred and jealousy you will bear. There are darkness found in all creation. The quarrels and and the wars, the grudges, the prejudices, all of it comes together to give birth to the ugliness that I am. Ah, I'm sorry, we couldn't catch it. This is what your negativity has brought. This doom is of your own making. All because the ugliestness within the hearts of Pokemon grew too great. You invited this upon yourselves. Were to blame? Naturally, Blake, Kobe. Cling to your precious planet and together with it. Be returned to nothingness. This is your end. Okay. So we're dead? Is there nothing we can do? Are we simply to watch the plan and approach with no hope left? <sighs> what, what is that? That roar. Everyone, look at the tree of life. You're right. The space surrounding the tree of life is being distorted. And look, something stopped it. It's not flying any higher. Bro? Bro! Do not underestimate the power of Pokemon! Bro! Yo, if we get 10 likes on this video, I wouldn't be surprised. Blaze, Kobe, can you hear me? A voice, where is it coming from? Listen to my words carefully. My name is Arceus. Arceus or Arceus? Let me just... Bringing together the power of all the Pokemon in this world, we shall slow the ascent of the Tree of Life. We will prevent it from reaching the sun. Let me just back up the camera a little bit. Oh, you're using the power of psychic type Pokemon. Those who can fly, fly or attacking directly from the sky. Yet, if we get too close, we will all be turned to stone. Well, not, well, duh. Ampharos, the same is true for you all. Us? That is right. 
Dark Matter is power is too strong from atop the Tree of Life. Their scars may have protected you all during your recent battle against the Velpo, but that will not be the case where you are to go next. Only those in direct contact with the scars will be protected from Dark Matter's ever-growing power. I see, then that leaves... Blaze and Kobe, as soon as you two are ready, I will transport you to the Tree of Life. You two are our final hopes. We must depend on you while we hold the Tree of Life back. The Fate Dark Matter. We will. I mean, we will. Thank you, Arceus. We'll find a way for sure. Then I will prepare to teleport you. I will contact you when things are ready. I wish you luck in the battle ahead. Wait, wait. We still have a shot, Ampharos. So our messages did reach them in time. Wait, what? What? Ampharos and Jirachi here. Travel far and wide trying to reach the allies we need would need to stay. While you two were in the Voidlands, Kobe, they were preparing for battle. And then and now the Pokemon have heeded the call. I have no idea. But that seems to be the end of our part in this battle. The rest is in your hands. Do your best. We'll give it our everything we've got. Blaze, this is our final battle. I don't know yet how we can possibly beat Dark Matter, but this is the chance that everyone worked so hard to give us. That's right, we can't let it go to waste. We owe them that much at least. We'll find a way to win. We'll do something about Dark Matter, you'll see. Let's do this, Blaze. Selby, let's take to the sky again. We can still help. Let's go add our power to stopping the Tree of Life's ascent. You're right, we should do go up there. Oh, I'm um, Celebi. You told me once before that you thought this battle would be mine to fight. I did. I just, well, I don't know what it is, but I think you were right. Anyways, you guys, we're going to go ahead and wrap up today's episode. So if you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you guys smash that like. Hopefully we can get to 8 likes and make sure you guys subscribe. And, if you get, and also let me know in the comments. If you were to become a Pokemon, what Pokemon would it be? And on that note, I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Peace.